Hi everyone, I just wanted to jump on here real quick and say thank you so much. I am over 500 subscribers and my mind was just blown away. I told my Chagia and my Chagia was like, wow. Okay, so Chagia means honey or sweetie in Korean. Just in case you guys wanted to know, because I am half Korean. Um, all right, so thank you so much for subscribing. Thank you so much for the comments, the likes, the shares. I really appreciate it, guys. So I have a chance to win video, and it's a chance to win a Two Souls Intertwine. Um, just go to my uh, channel, go to the videos, and then just scroll down until you see the chance to win. I will be announcing the winners on August 31st. So definitely comment on that video if you want a chance to win the two souls intertwined. So just for my new subscribers too, I want to sh I want to do a two souls intertwined reading now to see the weekend energies that's going to be going on. What's going on with the divine feminine and divine masculine and you know you don't have to be in a twin flame journey to have the divine feminine, divine masculine, all right? Soulmates are and catalysts are that too. Because, well, anyways, I mean, that's what I believe. Um, who knows? I might change my mind. I am a Sagittarius. So I went ahead and started it, but then my uh, memory went down, so I forgot I had to delete some videos. So, um... I'm just going to go ahead and lay the cards out, and then I will go through them one by one. Alright, so thus far, really good. So, the main focus of your read, guys, is that you two want to reunite, want to celebrate, alright? So, a person on side A, I'm going to go ahead and show all the cards. We have the Empress, Ace of Pentacles, Page of Cups, Five of Cups, and the King of Pentacles. Alright, so a person on side A is very abundant, very gorgeous, could be pregnant, alright? Uh, if you're pregnant, this baby could be a water sign, Pisces, or Cancer, but I'm really picking up on Pisces, alright? Um, <clears throat> so you're very abundant, you're very gorgeous, you know, you could be a guy and be the Empress too, okay? So you're very gorgeous, you're very handsome. Um... You're about to get an opportunity. Now, this opportunity could be a job or opportunity to grow your business. But whatever it is, if it's aside from a baby, this is going to bring you emotional fulfillment. It's like very young at its stage. So it's like really excited, you know, emotionally excited. And then on the bottom, we have the Five of Cups. So you could be mourning a loss or focused on the past or remembering something from the past that used to bring you fulfillment. This could be a past relationship. You need to turn around, boo. Look at them two of cups right there. A soulmate. Somebody feels the way you feel, but you just got to get out of those feels so you can enjoy them feels. Be present. Don't be stuck in the past. Don't let the past hit you in the... Yeah. And with the King of Pentacles, this could be an Earth sign, Jim, um, Jesus, Earth sign, uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or it could be Water sign, uh, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. And then with the Empress here, I always say the Empress embodies all four queens, so that Empress could be any sign, okay? On side B, we have Eight of Swords, The Lovers. Four of Pentacles, Six of Wands, and the Will of Fortune. Hope I'm still going strong here. Awesome. So what we have here is we have Gemini, sign of Gemini, and uh, 
Sagittarius. Alright, so maybe, um, let's see. Maybe earth, air, and fire. No water on this side. Um, so this person feels stuck, trapped, but they're, what they're stuck to is one of two things. They're stuck to a big decision they have to make. Um, make it three. They're stuck to a Gemini. They're tied to a Gemini. They're bound to a Gemini. Um, or... They're stuck in love. And the reason why I say stuck is because you have the Four of Pentacles and the Eight of Swords. I mean, that's tied and bound, and that's like not move, not letting go, not, move, not moving, nothing. You're just, you're holding on to it for dear life. All right? So you're holding on to a situation. You're staying put, basically. You're not going anywhere. Um, because there's a decision you have to make, or you're not going in, you're not leaving a Gemini side, or your lover's side. You're not going to leave them. And what's cool is you get victory. You get recognize, recognition, victory, um, success, right? Because the wheel of fortune is turning. So this person has luck on their side. And it's just amazing to me. The reason why this person has luck on their side is because they have love. All right. Love is the highest vibration anybody can give. You want to learn anything about like the seven chakras and stuff. Learn to love. Love is the highest vibration. It can open up so many things. All right. So the intertwining part. Both of you feel like you need to block out people that are opposing you. Um, you're blocking out um again people talking junk about e you or trying to influence you in how you make your decisions or you're just blocking out other people that are trying to come at you like trying to holler at you or trying to get with you trying to get your number and stuff you do know why because you want this commitment both of you want this commitment both of you want this relationship both of you just want to take it to another level and so what is advised to do is to use your brain use your logic use your intellect cut off what no mo no longer emotionally satisfies you because the king of swords is emotionally detached he looks at it from a different point of view all right so Look at things from a different point of view, both of you, all right? What I'm seeing here, too, in the center is I'm picking up marriage for some reason. Like, the Hierophant and, like, this could be a judge. Like, you know, at the magistrate's office. And this could be like a priest. Marriage is what I'm getting from that. Or somebody's in the service. And if you are in the service, thank you so much. For risking your lives and stuff. You know, it's not easy doing whatever needs to be done for a piece or whatever. You know, I do have a lot of military friends, so I really appreciate that I get to do these readings. I get to upload this video. I get to do the things that I get to do because they fought for that right for me. So I do appreciate that. Um, okay, so we're going to go into the uh, Angel Answers cards. So person on side A... <laughs> Perfect timing. Hey, great success. Person B. Be assertive. 
take control assert yourself you made it this far right and then the center for both of you recovery rest relax recover because you two have been through some hard stuff and that recovery could just be that moment where you two get to hug each other and just embracing each other gives you that sense of everything's gonna be all right like this is what I'm doing this for I'm doing this for love that's what I am feeling so I hope you guys like this reading if it resonated please hit that like thumbs up uh, comment and I guess I will be picking random winners five random winners for my chance to win video so check that video out if you want a chance to win a free two souls intertwine reading with clarifiers I didn't even use clarifiers here um and thank you again bye